is. Guess who's back? Um, me and Percival, the never ending crying cat. What is the matter? So, yes, I've decided to um, start vlogging again. So it's Monday night, I've just got in from work. Um, I'd planned this kind of week to start vlogging again. Um, I think I picked the wrong week because everything's gone wrong. Um, I picked it because it's my birthday on Sunday, this Sunday coming up. Um, and I'm going to France and Belgium for the weekend. Scar all over. Um, a lot of firms. But if you follow me on social media, you will know that my house is flooded. Um, I had my stepdad come around last week. I started getting mould on like the bathroom wall. <clears throat> so um, I asked him to come around and then I noticed water coming up through the tiled floor in the bathroom. Um, then in the hallway outside the bathroom, the laminate was like really squishy and spongy when you walked on it and water was seeping up. So he came around to look at that for me and ended up pulling up all my hallway floor. And it was just sodden with water. Luckily, I live in a flat, so it's concrete underneath. So it had, um, it had not like gotten into the wood and rotted it or anything. But yeah, all my washing machine broken, had broken. So we thought that's what the leak was from. Like maybe the washing machine had broken and it had emptied the tank out into the utility cupboard, which had then got into the bathroom and the hallway. Turns out it's not because we pulled all that out disconnected it that's now sat in my hallway I'm living like a troll at the minute because there's just stuff everywhere let me see if I can show you take you on a journey please excuse stuff all over the floor but yeah this is currently how I live there we've got my washing machine here shoes I can't show you that because it's got my dress on um yeah, stains all over my floor, Percy's poo box, but as you can tell, I've actually just mopped this up since I got in, and when I got in it was all pooled and puddled, like seriously I could have done a little dance in it in welly boots, so how cute are my slippers, how cute, um, but yeah, so I mopped that up about five minutes ago and it's already piss wet through again. So this is how I live, like a troll, like a little troll monster. Percy's loving it though, he loves to like do stuff with the washing machine. I don't know what he's doing, but yeah. So kids, all my work stuff everywhere, work clothes. So yes, there's fur all over my bed. Percy's not even that much of a furry cat. So yeah, that's catch up time, story time with Hayley. Um, what else has gone in my life? Not a lot really. Um, that is about it. I got a ring light for YouTube and I haven't been doing YouTube. Also, there's gin on my desk. Um, please don't think that I've been drinking gin whilst on the computer. <laughs> it's there to prop the window open. I did get these though. How cute are these? Ta-da! Look how pretty they look! Without all the crap under my desk. What are you doing? Hey? So yes, Percy is still a naughty boy. Haven't really missed much else. Um, bought a ring light yet? about it nothing really else interesting what do you want what are you crying at he does this every night I get in <coughs> unless I sit down and play with him and have like cuddles and stuff then he like <laughs> cries like a little girl I go try sort him out um, so what's the plan for this week for you all? I am going to, what am I going to do? Take some more pictures tonight. Probably not much else will happen this week because I have to try and figure out what the feck I'm going to do with 
the hallway water situation. I don't know if you noticed, um, but what makes it bad, it's not just a case of like fixing the toilet. The toilet cistern is tiled into the back wall. And then, so it just looks like like the toilet base. Um, yeah, so it's not just a case of let's lift the cistern and see if the ball cocks all right. That's the only toilet terms I know. Um, so yeah, you have to like take out the whole back of the tiles and I'm just like, please don't ruin my tiles. What? So yeah, and it's just a really shit time because my washer's broke, my washer dryer's broke. So I'm having to take all my laundry up to my mum's. Um, I have nothing to dry my clothes with here. So I'm using towels to mop up all the water and then have nothing to dry the towels with. Not good. So that's going to cost me like 150, 200 quid for a new washer. Um, it cost me 40 quid to replace the flooring in the hallway. Lord knows how much for a plumber to sort out whatever the fuck's going on in the bathroom so much swearing so yeah um that's it in my princess pajamas i'm gonna go take some blog pictures and then have some vegan burgers with a salad and then watch some youtube maybe finish watching hannibal if you dare do anything to them curtains i will tan your ass you might notice there's new curtains. Why? Because Percy decided he wanted to um, start climbing them and beside Spider-Man. So he climbed them and ripped all the lining. And again, I looked like I lived like a troll because you could just see big holes in the lining of the curtains. Which is fun. But yeah, I'm going to go take some blog pictures. I might do a time lapse. Me taking blog pictures. It'll be all fancy AF. My first time back blogging. Vlogging. Yeah, this week, probably not that interesting. Um, even when I go to France and Belgium, I'm basically going for my birthday and on a cig run and a beer run. Because yes, I'm a dirty smoker and a dirty drinker. But yeah, you can get like three pound bottle of wines, which are really nice from France. So we're gonna do that in time for Christmas. And that is about it. So um, yeah. Yay for back vlogging, vlogging, again, did it again. Also, I'm gonna try really hard with main channel videos as well. I've got um, Monday off work after I get back from France and Belgium. So I'm gonna try bulk film a load. We will see how that goes. We will see how vlogging goes. So how rough do I look? Right, okay, bye. Click on how to turn my camera off. I'm gonna open. <gasps> oh, not allowed up there. What are you doing? That's mummy's advent calendar. Um. So yeah, I'm gonna open the door today. I think it's the sixth. I'm gonna be gutted when I'm away this weekend and can't open it. Place you there. You can look at my pants. Plants for a minute. Not my pants. Oh my god, Percy got them. Open the down. So today it is the focus, focus, Ico Skinny Liquid Liner in black and mini version. Um, I hate this eyeliner, it dries up like a bitch. Um, what else did we have? The first day we got the Rodio, Rodio, um Super Acids Face Peel and we had the Ren Ever Calm Face Cream. 
Ben Filaraga Time Filler Pixie by Petra Brow Tamer and the Josh Wood I think it's hair oil Radiant Shine yes so this is the M&S Advent Calendar I love it also look at my little plant garden they're all fake um, yes I love them also I think I've cracked the water problem Hi guys, wow, that's not even focusing. That's me. Um, I've been like the worst vlogger this week. My bedroom's a shit tip. Yeah, so I've been the worst vlogger this week because my life's just so pants at the moment. The leak's still not fixed. Let me take my hair down. I just threw it up when I got in. Oh, wow. It's because I'm worth it. Um, but yes, move purse. Cosmic. Um, yeah, I still have a leak in my bathroom. Um, so my stepdad just came round. Um, I was told that you have to um, take the mirror off to get to the back of the toilet because I switch you around. As you can tell it's um, tiled in and can you see this is my giant mirror it's massive like really big apparently you have to take this off to be able to get to the back of the toilet stuff so um he just came around he took the mirror off and there's like a half foot gap i'm not focusing <clears throat> there's like a half foot gap at the back he climbed in and he thought it was the waste pipe which was my worst nightmare because if it is you have to get somebody like dino rod to come out and like unblock the blockage but it's not thankfully um apparently it's just one of the pipes that goes to the system so that was good um but he couldn't fix it he said he didn't want to attempt it and then have to come again in two months time and rip the mirror off again like, look at my paw mirror. It's just hanging by a thread. What are you doing? What are you doing in there? Careful, there's a kniff. There's a kniff. But yeah, he just messaged me. I was, I was leaving work at like half five. And he was like, right, I'm coming round now. And so I had all my products there and all under there. And now they're all in my shower. Just had to dump them in there. And up there. Um, so yes, anyway, he took the back off. Um, climbed in. He said um, my plumber, uncle, family friend, person is going to come round on Saturday and attempt to fix it. Um, either the pipe or just rip the cistern out and put a new one in. So it's going to cost me a nice little sum. But yeah, this is why we've not really been vlogging. Because my life. Because every morning I'm having me to get up and like mop this up. But he's managed to isolate it now. He's managed to isolate it. So, so he put the mirror back on, screwed it in and realised he could isolate the water to the toilet because I've having, been having to turn my water off. And then like turn it back on, running quickly, get a five minute shower, wash my face and stuff. But he's isolated now so I can have the water on. But just not the toilet. But... It's Thursday night. Um, I go to France at like, I think picked up at about three o'clock Saturday morning. So we've only tomorrow to get through, and then they're coming round to do it whilst I'm not here. <laughs> what are you doing on there? You having a poo on the toilet? <laughs> you having a poo on the toilet? <laughs> Look, right, the the leak has been so bad. It's caused mold on my walls. You can see like the little black spots and then this like furry stuff. I'm sure you're loving this. I hope none of you are eating. Um, so yeah, that's how I realised there was a problem. But Sharon from That Stargazy Vegan recommended me like the best product ever. It's not product placement, I promise. Um, and you spray it on and then the mould just like melts off the walls. But 
because the leak is still, that was the flattering angle, because the leak is still happening in my situation, the mould keeps coming back. So, yes. I have to buy some more of that because once the leak's fixed, everything's dried out and I have to demould everything again because fuck my life. F my life, sorry. <laughs> Shouldn't swear on the YouTubes. I'm pretty sure as well, if you're swearing now, your videos get demonetized. There goes me, my full-time vlogging dream. Um, yes. Um, that's about it. It's been a bit of a crap week for vlogging and just in general for me. As you can see, it's taken its toll. Look, so rough. Look at spots galore. Let's see. I'm just like, so spotty. It's, um, it's not been good to me as stress. It's just one thing after another. So I'm going to get this fixed. And it's annoying as well because you can bring 90 litres of wine slash Prosecco back from France. Um, what? Uh, which is 120 bottles. And so the money that I'm having to pay for the plumber and stuff and new flooring was going to be my... Um, Prosecco money. I was going to bring like 20, 30 bottles of Prosecco back because I'm an alcoholic. alcoholic. Um, but yeah, no, I can't. What? Do you want to be on the video? You want to be on? Oh, Dad? Who is it? He's whinging because we haven't cuddled yet. Where are you going? Yes, that was going to be my Prosecco money. So now I'm going to be like limited, depending on how much it is a bottle. Sad times. Hi guys, so we're finally here. Um, finally on the, well not here, finally on the ferry. Um, I've had a fair few glasses of Prosecco from the giant Prosecco Magnum that my mum bought. Um, so yeah, but um, I'm just about to go onto the smoking deck to try get some footage because it'll be outside and get some footage of the sea and stuff. So, it'll be fun. Um, it's been a long day, I had about 40 minutes sleep last night. I was up at 20 past two this morning on the coach and stuff, had about 40 minutes on the coach and it's now about half past 11ish and I am knackered. Feels like five in the afternoon for me. So we're gonna, once we get to Calais, we're then gonna go into Belgium and um, check out like the shops and stuff in Belgium and then come back, go for something to eat tonight and then into France tomorrow for wine. So um, I'll take you with me. Oh my gosh, it's so windy. Um, but yeah, we're up on the deck. And as you can see, there's all that stuff. Um, so yeah, it's really windy and cold out here. So I think I'm gonna go in. But I think I caught some good footage. And I had to like um, <coughs> quit quite early on the stairs because there were people there and they were staring at me. And they're doing it now. I'm so not used to this. Vlogging, vlogging in public malarkey. Um, but yes, as I did my eyebrows on the coach today, I'm quite impressed with how they turned out. They're still shit, but not as shit as they should be. around the streets, find somewhere to get like a nice cold drink. Um, this is my outfit of the day. I bought this top online in like, when I've got my nice silver shoes on, 
I bought this top online in the new look, like Friday sales. And I got a size that I usually am in the new look. Fat people, plus size range. And it's seriously like three sizes too big for me. But I've already taken the tags off so I can't take it back. And also because it was in the sale, I don't really have any more of it. I'm gutted because it's such a beautiful colour. It's like a dusky pink velvet off the shoulder kind of thing um, but yeah it's massive so if I take my coat off I then have to tie it because it's so big but this is where we're staying it is an Ivy Styles which is really cute and this is in Calais lots of tinsel oh she's there well, mister. Um, could you get me one, please? Because I don't have any euros. I told you to get some euros. But I didn't have my purse on me, do you know? Oh, so, cute seats. Um, this is my mum. Uh, let's show you around a little bit. of cute Christmas stuffs. If my phone, uh, my camera would focus. What else do we have? A little lift. And gifts. Coffee. And then all this, I love this ceiling. And all this big expansive stuff. They're so cute, aren't they? I just vlogged them. So yeah, um, I have my little I can't be asked to wash my hair, space bun thing on, which hasn't gone very well because um, I forgot my proper bubble. And yes, oh, my feet are hurting already. Got new shoes on, which are these cute. I'll turn you around. Oh, that was a sexy shot with the chins. Um, these cute little new look shoes, but they're wide foot. But they still hurt a little bit. They're so cute. What? <gasps> what is it? It's called uh, beer. Um. <laughs> really? They don't have that in England. <laughs> They're giant. Thank you. So apparently this is lager, but yeah, it's like an amber colour. I'm not convinced. Apparently you can have a taste. <laughs> it's giant for the size of my head. I just got lager. It's not what we got. It's not. Yeah. Drink that way because it's got my lipstick mask on. You don't want to put lipstick. It's like I a like really it. fruity. Like it. You like a fruity beer? It's like a fruity, foisted beer. Yeah. It's, 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 it tastes like. Is it creepy. leafy? Mm. Leffy. Leffy. It's, it's nice. Is that yours and. My name. Oh, I thought that was Gemma's. She's getting ready. Which. Morning, guys. So it's my birthday. Yay. Officially 31 today. Um, I'm old. Feeling hella old. Just getting ready to go down to breakfast and get some lots of coffee. I look really rough. See there, sort my hair out. <coughs> so we're going wine shopping today, slash prosecco shopping. And um where's my water? And then apparently we're going to some kind of centre thing that has normal stuff so we're gonna have a look around there but I'd be quite happy just to get home get back and see my little Percival it's my birthday made it made it home last night as well because my mum left me in the bar <laughs> um, so yeah I'll check in with you later 
so we are now in the wine shop and look at it rows and rows of wine and baguettes right we were drawn to these because obviously colourful but now I'm just going to shut up and take you with us what is it? It's really big. Um, we've been looking at more alcohol. I feel like I've got a red patch here. Um, but yeah, so we've been looking at more alcohol. There's so many shops here, and it's so nice. Um, we're gonna go grab a little snack, I think, and then have a little wander around some more, and then go on the coach back to the ferry. But we went into Sephora. And there wasn't really anything that I want. Well, I wanted clothes in there, but there's nothing I was going to buy in there. Um, but I wanted a Sephora lipstick. This one, like the one closest to me, and they didn't have it. And I'm not sad. But yeah, we're going to go grab some eats now. So I will check in with you soon. I think. So I look like poo. Um, <clears throat> oh, that was a bit of a strangled voice. Um, I've just got back. It's about half past nine at night. Percival is like being really loving what? Um, because he's missed me um, what else has happened oh I got a nice surprise um, so my washing machine is now fitted the leak is now fixed cut my hair out <laughs> what am I not paying you attention enough am I not am I not so yeah I cut my hair out <clears throat> um, and yeah so my leak's fixed Washing machine, washing machine is fitted and ready to go in the morning and um, my flooring's been done. My dad, stepdad, dad? Yeah, my dad went and got me um, some flooring when he'd finished the bathroom and decided to put it down in the hallway from where we'd had to rip it up. Um, and it looks really good, I'd show you, but my house is an absolute mess because I wasn't expecting him to do that. Oh, and I wasn't expecting him to um, like take the old washing machine away or anything, but he has. And that was all in the hallway with like stuff piled on it. What? What? Come on then. And he's fitted it. But yeah, so all like the rubbish and stuff is just all over my house. Um, yeah, it's a proper mess. But it looks really nice, the flooring. Um, he sent me a picture well, he sent my mum a picture and so yeah it looks really nice um i actually said it looks better than the flooring in the living room slash kitchen um, and i might get him to now put the same one throughout and in my bedroom because i have carpet in here and it's cream but it's about six years old now and it's a little bit tatty and knackered in places especially near where i do my makeup um, but yeah, it's been a fun trip. Um, didn't really get to see much of like France and stuff. Um, I think we're gonna go back, me and my mum, in May in her camper van, and do a wine run, and also get to like spend a little bit, like do two nights and spend a little time in um, Calais town and stuff. Come on, pudding, have you missed me? Have you? So yes, it's been fun. Um, I got oh my god, wine is so cheap. Um, we were in like, first we went to, oh my god my hair, um, like a wine um, warehouse thing and um, I got six bottles of Prosecco for a, well, a case of six for £21 and it's actually really nice stuff, I've got a bottle now because I'm going to have a couple of glasses, it's really nice and then I got two bottles of, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's called Cante or Ciante um, the lighting's terrible because I've got that light on over there. Let me turn that off. Um, yes, yeah, so I got six bottles of this extra dry one, and then I got two bottles of Chianti, which was three pound ninety nine a bottle. But I'm pretty sure I've seen it in shops for about twelve quid a bottle over here. Um, and then I got some Lemoncello for twelve quid. 
spirits and stuff because I, I wanted like loads of different gins but spirits and stuff were similar prices to over here but over here at this time of year you get stuff that's like in the supermarkets for 15 quid um, like on special offer for Christmas and so it just wasn't worth it for spirits and I'm not a big wine drinker I drink more Prosecco but I think if we go back in May I'm gonna get a taste for wine before I go and stock up because there were some really nice wines um, my mum bought a box of six for £12 but there was also a box of six for £8.50 which is ridiculous it's like £1.30 a bottle or something my mouth is pants so yeah and it was actually nice nice stuff so it's exciting um, but I've got back and I was there and I thought my battery pack because I didn't take my like proper full on charger I took my battery pack I thought it had died so I've been like conserving my battery all day and I'm now on 3% now and I've gone to plug my charger in and it won't work so and I broke my other charger the other day um, I must have been I turned my light off I must have been trying to get my phone out of the socket during the night and pulled like the little thing out that goes oh, my nails are filthy that goes into I show it the little thing that goes into your phone and it, oh that was a flattering angle the little thing that goes into your phone um, I pulled it out of the actual charger so yeah that wasn't a good idea because now I only have one charger and it doesn't seem to be working but it's not split or anything and it's not crinkled at either end which is the case with iPhone chargers a lot of the time because I stole it from work because um, a lot of people have work phones there and a guy handed his back and um, the manager was like oh yeah just take the charger out of it because I'm always begging for chargers at work like can I borrow yours and now it doesn't work I have no idea what I'm going to do luckily I'm not in work tomorrow so I don't have to like get up or anything but yeah I'm going to have to like walk into town tomorrow and get one which is annoying because I wanted to spend a day sorting my house out because it's an absolute pigsty at the minute and I'm knackered I'm absolutely knackered so um, I probably got about seven hours sleep last night um, not much on Friday night What's that thing down my top not much on Friday night because yeah we was up at for the coach at 20 past two and I'd not got to sleep till about half one and I had about 40 minutes on the coach and stuff so yeah I'm knackered uh, but I'm gonna go I'm gonna sign off the the return of the weekly vlog I'm gonna sign off and probably start vlogging again tomorrow hopefully I don't have anything planned this week coming up um but yeah lots of washing I'm gonna do lots of washing I'm so excited to do a shitload of washing my washing basket's right at the side of me because they had to move it so they could because it's behind the door and they had to be able to put the door fully back to get the flooring underneath um so yeah my washing's currently at the side of me and I'm just like oh it's so much so I'm excited to do lots of washing tomorrow and probably some cleaning well lots of cleaning and um, maybe some Netflix and go buy a charger because mine obviously doesn't want to work I have no idea what I'm going to do they think I might have a cable somewhere that um, went with the battery pack I don't know I'll have to check I think I got some from some Avon stocking filler stuff um, but yeah I'm going to sign off because I need to go find a charger or something and I need to get drunk because it's my birthday it's my birthday today oh that's why I wanted to show that's why I went up to vlog something on my hand so I got some cards for some bloggers so this one's from Carrie from Beauties Unlocked um, and she made the cakes for the awards and for the girl gang and it says happy birthday Hayley wish I could wish I could have sent you my lemon cake but this will have to do and I absolutely adore Carrie's lemon cake it's amazing oh careful what what's the matter with you it's okay pudding he's having his mad hour um, and she sent me some Dr Oatka um, mug cake in lemon flavour which is so cute I love that and then I also got a card 
tramp. A little kitten on the front. Um, the, from Suhi Chips. Um, that's Sophie from Essential 20. She put, Dear Hayley, happy birthday, 21 again, question mark. Um, Sorry I couldn't celebrate with you in the other shrooms. I hope you have a great day. I'll celebrate with you in the new year and then, and maybe even share my chips, although probably not. Love from Suhi Ship. Chips. I can't speak. So tired. And then she sent me a Christmas card as well, um, which is so cute. Hello, penguin. And on there it says, Happy Chipmas. And then she drew me some little chips. Suhi is obsessed with chips. So that's the whole chip thing. Um, but yes, I'm going to go now, I promise. I'm going to go get my wine and sort my charger out on my hair. Oh, it's a mess. It's rank. So I hope you have a brilliant week and I hope you had a lovely weekend. I hope you have a nice weekend coming up because this will be going up Wednesday. But yeah, um, don't forget to like and subscribe. Kids, you know the drill. What? What? Come on, pudding. Come on, then. Come on for a cuddle with your mum. Um, but yeah, like and subscribe, kids, for more Percival. Whoring out my cat.